Did you know Lynette survived a helicopter crash in the Colorado mountains covering a news story in the 90s? Amazingly, she walked away with moderate injuries and her courageous story was featured in a documentary. And did you know if Lynette wasn't a news anchor, she'd be a doctor or teacher. She was pre-med until scholarships and grants ran out when she switched to journalism. She vows in her next life that she'll be a doctor, caring for preemies in the NICU. Now you know. <laughs> oh, wow. I just learned something. I right? didn't know all that. Now you yeah. know. Oh, so my gosh. Cool. I mean, where, where do you even start there? That's I know. such fascinating. You said, the, I okay. mean, talking about your mom yeah. after the crash, right? So I was at, I was at KOSA in Denver, mm. and we were covering a story on Pikes Peak, and, um, and we crashed. And, oh, my goodness. You know, thank goodness for... Art Hill and Kirk Selby. Yeah. Art was the, the pilot, mm -hmm. and he was he was a pilot in the, the Vietnam War, so he had an amazing experience. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He found the one place on Pikes Peak that we could crash and and not, you know, blow It'd be up okay, yeah, because yeah. it was like it was a it was a crash. Um, and Kirk had strapped me in right before we took off, and uh, we all walked away. So wow. thank it's God for them. That's and amazing for for me surviving. Yeah. But yeah. you know, you just you never know what you're going to be covering one day, and you know the, the dangers and the things that we end up having to do. But yeah. um, to see my mom right there, I remember we, we walked off the off of Pikes Peak um, during a live broadcast during the four o'clock show <laughs> on KUSA, and I could hear my mom crying. You know, oh. like that wail that you're you know Latina moms do. <laughs> <laughs> she was, I can still hear her doing that, but she was, it was a happy cry, but yeah. it, you know, I, it, and she was just so happy to kind of get her arms around yeah. me, so. And then we had these block phones. I don't know if, yeah. if you ever watched the story. <laughs> yeah. There's a phone that's the size of like, a, you know, a laptop. That was the phone that we were using to call for help. Yeah. Uh, it wow. was something else. So yeah. did you have fear going into it? Like I've always been kind of a little bit cautious in terms of helicopters. And have you ever have you been on one since? Um, I was not afraid. I loved it. It was yeah. September, um, and it was so the, the the aspen leaves were changing. It was so beautiful. I remember going, "Oh my gosh, I'm so like I have the best job in the whole wide world. This is so great." And then it wasn't so great. Mm. Um, and no, I've never flown again. In fact, they wanted to airlift us out because it was such a remote area of Pikes mm -hmm. Peak, and they said, "Oh, it's going to take you know eight hours for you know rescuers to come and get you. You're going to have to get, take a hel helicopter to get out." And I'm like. Really? I'll wait. <laughs> it's okay, I'll wait. No, I actually just happening. fell out of the sky. Yeah, yeah. I really don't no, really want to get in a helicopter. Yeah, that's not yeah. So yeah, we didn't we didn't do that. But um <sighs> no, and in fact I used to have nightmares about um the crash and mm. it would turn into a roller coaster mm -hmm. oh. in my mind. Wow. It's amazing how your mind kind yeah. of like changes things. Yeah. So then I became afraid of roller coasters. Mm -hmm. Oh no. I know, but now I can do roller coasters. Not very well. I cry when I get off of them. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, so do we. <laughs> yeah, You're not, not alone. alone. Yeah. Yeah. Gosh, yeah. you have done so much and uh, we're going to have more stories throughout the morning. It's just incredible. Um, you know, the, all the experience that you bring along with yeah. you. So we're just so grateful that you're here with us. You. And if you need me to take your blood pressure, I can, I can do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's usually high during the show. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right.